Okay, so we got so the air pump. Air pump right here, 23 watt air pump. Mm -hmm. And then it is connected to a hose that diverts it off into many different mm -hmm. um, of our components here. So always one air pump that comes down to the airlift on the water here, constantly pressurizing the pipe. So the water will come in from the filter and it'll get locked in here by the check valve. But because the water is continuously pressurizing, I mean the air is continuously pressurizing the pipe, it has to go out somewhere. So it comes out from this overflow pipe, which gets pumped upwards. And then it comes into the cinder bed, which this one will ebb and flow. And then filter out the cinder bed and the fish water. And then it will release it from the overflow pipe is here. So when the water gets filled up top to the overflow amount, mm -hmm. it's going to overflow. And here's our bell housing right here. That will trigger the water and then flow out back cool. to the fish tank. So now we don't have to worry about our submergible pump where we used to do that at the beginning is in the water. You have to always clean the filter. Mm -hmm. You always have to go inside and clean the inside with all the um, debris that gets caught in there. Mm -hmm. We don't have to worry about what comes through this night. See, if you look what's flowing through there, all the fish poop, yeah. all the debris going through here, we don't have to worry about that plugging up our pipes anymore, um, our pumps anymore. It'll automatically just go you through find? up and over. Did you find that you need a certain uh, amount of PSI for this to operate? Just this one. This one is the least smallest pump. The like Hako, this yeah. is the 23 watt. The 0 0.34 amp. So, um, a, lot of the, a lot of the systems that we utilize is done with that 23 watt mm -hmm. pump. That's about 150, right? Or 200? It's not, yeah, about 150, 165, I think, at the, um, $1 piece store. What is this one called? A compression or? Yeah, this one is a check valve. Check valve. Check valve. That's so you don't let the water in. Yeah. When the compression, when the water is getting pumped up, it lets it in, but the water can't go back out. Sure. But it's normally not clear, it's only for display. It's You bought a clear yeah. one, right? Right. Right. And he's using air holes, pushing into here. And let's see, this part's going, looks like the intake from the uh, fish tank. It's pushing water up this channel. It's like an exhaust. And the water, you can see he's gurgling here. And it's dumping into here. Why is he doing that? Just that's how that's how high the pump that he has pumping the water up can go and even higher. So he just uses that as a demonstration. Oh, you've got to get up that time.